Islam by Hudi Yusuf, Vivo, Bianca Soto, and Samantha Ricks. Islam is a monotheistic religion expressed by the Quran, a religious text considered to be the words of God slash Allah, and for the vast majority of adherents by the teachings of Muhammad, considered by most of them to be the last prophet of God. Muslims believe that God is one and has no equal, and that the purpose of existence is to worship God. Islam started out in Arabia, now known as Saudi Arabia, in the Middle East where the prophet Muhammad was born, raised, lived, and died. Islam is the youngest religion in the world, only starting in AC, but many Muslims disagree with that and believe that Islam began before the Prophet roamed the earth. Muhammad dictated the Quran, the holy book of Islam, which Muslims believe to be the pre-existent, perfect words of Allah. But by Muslims, the Quran didn't originate with Muhammad. The Quran testifies to itself that it was given by God through angel Jibreel to the Prophet. Islam has five pillars that are primary obligations that each Muslim must fulfill in his or her lifetime. The first pillar is the testimony of faith, is saying with conviction, La ilaha illallah Muhammadu Rasulu Allah, that there is no true God but Allah, and Muhammad is the messenger of God. The first part, there is no true God but Allah, means that no one has the right to be worshipped but God alone, and that God has neither partner nor son. The testimony of faith is called the Shahada, and it's the simple words that should be said with no conviction in order to convert to Islam. The testimony of faith is the most important pillar of Islam. The second pillar is prayer. Muslims must pray five prayers a day. Each prayer does not take more than a few minutes to perform. Prayer in Islam is the direct link between the worshipper and God. Prayers perform at dawn, noon, mid-afternoon, sunset, and night. A Muslim may pray anywhere, in fields, offices, factories, or schools. The third pillar is giving zakah slash support of the needy. All things belong to God, and wealth is therefore held by human beings in trust. Giving zakah means giving a specified percentage on certain properties to certain classes of needy people. The fourth pillar is fasting in the month of Ramadan. Every year in the month of Ramadan, all Muslims fast from dawn to sundown, abstaining from food and drink. Fasting is regarded principally as a method of spiritual self-purification. By cutting oneself off from worldly comforts, even for a short time, a fasting person gains true sympathy with those who go hungry. The last pillar is the pilgrimage to Makkah. The annual pilgrimage, Hajj, to Makkah is an obligation once in a lifetime for those who are physically and financially able to perform it. About 2 million people go to Makkah each year to perform Hajj in the 12th month of the Islamic calendar. The rites of Hajj include circling the Kaaba seven times and going seven times between the hillocks of Safa and Marwa, as Hagar did during her search for water. Then the pilgrims stand together in Ahra and ask God for what they wish for and his, for his forgiveness. The end of Hajj is marked by a festival, Eid al-Adha, which is celebrated with prayers and the slaughtering of sheep. This and Eid al-Fitr, a feast day commemorating the end of Ramadan, the two annual festivals of Muslim calendar. The expansion of Islam for one of civilization's greatest empire. Muslims were encouraged by Prophet Muhammad and his successors to spread the word of Islam by God's will. By the 7th century, Muslims have spread the word from Arabia to Damascus, Jerusalem, Cairo, Alexandria, and Isfahan. Between the lands that they control and the, reg and the regions with which they traded, Muslims were in contact with almost the entire world. Islamic Fundamentalism what is it? A foreign religion that upholds belief in strict literal in interception of scriptures. Islamic fundamentalists oppose the infiltration of secular and westernizing influences and seek to institute Islamic law, including strict codes of behavior. Typically, fundamentalists are against modernism and Western culture and they promote violence in order to please God. Basic Timeline of Fundamentalism 1979 Ayatollah Rahullah Kiyomanya takes over Iran where he establishes fundamentalism. Under his rule, women were denied of equal rights, required to wear a veil, and ban Western cultures, along with reinforcements of Islamic law and brutal punishments, such as stoning, cutting off fingers of women who wear nail polish, and burning. 1900s, Taliban, fundamentalist and terrorist group of Iran, come to power. The Taliban is especially known for restricting women's rights. 2001, Muslim extremists attacked the U.S., i.e. 9-11. 2003, Saddam Hussein outsed by the U.S. and other forces. Fundamentalism in Iran. The dispute of fundamentalism within Iran is a type of operational dispute. 
as in how the boundary should work as many fundamentalists try to take over the government. Who are involved are the Imperial State of Iran, Revolutionary Council, Islamic Revolution Committees, Islamic Republican Party, National Front, National Democratic Front, FMI, Two-Day Party, FEDAI, Union of Communist Militants, MEK, Arab Nationalists, Kurdish Nationalists, and Balog Nationalists. The conflict within Iran is fueling the help of Afghanistan who supplied shelter, weapons, and other items. Iran women don't have many rights now. Most are required to wear veils and men control wives, daughters, and unmarried sisters. Men are often married to more than one woman. Fundamentalism in Afghanistan the Taliban Islamic fundamentalist group that ruled Afghanistan for almost 20 years until the U.S. invasion 2003 and is the Al-Qaeda home to the radical Islamic terrorist group. Fundamentalism in Saudi Arabia it is often described as being responsible for the popularity of contemporary Islamic fundamentalism. Saudi Arabia is also largely governed by fundamentalist principles of the Wahhabi movement, a religious movement or branch of Sun Sunni Islam. It has been variously described as ultra-conservative, strict, fundamentalist, puritanical, and as an Islamic reform movement to restore pure monotheistic worship, also called Tawid, and as an extremist pseudo sunni sunni movement. Fundamentalist groups. Islamic State based in Iraq in 2010, the leader of fundamentalist group took advantage of the civil war in Syria and set up the Al-Nusra Front. They have created problems for the U.S. and other Western nations. Al-Qaeda, Sunni Islamic fundamentalist terrorist group formed by Osama bin Laden, carried out the 9-11 attack of the Twin Towers in the Pentagon against the U.S. Other fundamentalist groups include Abu Sayyaf, Ansar Islam, Armed Islamic Group of Algeria, Army of Islam, Boko Haram, Taliban, Egyptian Islam, Jihad, Lashkar al Taliba. Tashi, Muhammad, Jima'a, Islamia, Harqatul Jihad al-Islamiyya.